What you are seeing now appears to be a fun family vacation, consisting of swimming with colorful creatures, splashing around in crystal blue water, and eating fish tacos on the shore. My family and I came away from this vacation with many pictures and memories. During the trip, we did not think we were doing anything harmful to the environment and species around us. However, looking back, there are many mistakes that we made that harmed the environment we were in and the animals around us. This is the Johnson family. They have never been to a tropical island before and are very excited to see all the plants and wildlife. The Johnsons are getting ready for a relaxing day on the beach. They bring several water bottles to stay hydrated and pack fruit in plastic bags. However, a storm comes and it begins to rain and thunder. The family, in a hurry to get out of the storm, quickly pack their things up, leaving many plastic water bottles and bags on the beach. High tide comes and pulls the plastic into the ocean. The turtle is swimming and spots the plastic. He mistakes the plastic for food and attempts to eat the plastic. This results in him choking and dying. There are many harmful chemicals in the plastic that can be harmful to animals that consume them. These chemicals travel up the food chain and affect many species. Animals can also become entangled in plastic, causing their movement to be restricted and possibly result in death. Knowing the consequences, what would you choose if you are now given the choice between a reusable or a plastic water bottle? The Johnsons are going snorkeling today. Before they go in the water, they lather up with sunscreen to protect themselves from the sun's harmful rays. They see many fish along with the colorful coral reef. Upon taking a closer look, the coral reef was broken by the fins of the girl while she was in shallow water. The sunscreen lathered on her body contains harmful chemicals that causes the rate of coral bleaching to speed up. Coral bleaching results in a once bright and vibrant colorful reef to become white and colorless. The sunscreens safe for the coral reefs are more expensive, so many do not buy them. When buying sunscreen for your next vacation, consider the consequences of which sunscreen you choose. Today, the Johnsons have a beach day. They bring food with them to feed the wildlife. The girl feeds the fish. The fish are comfortable being close to her, and the food attracts a large group of fish. Many people are guilty of feeding wildlife because it allows them to closely interact with the animals. However, negative consequences include changes in population and migratory patterns, increase in aggression, and insufficient nutrients. Next time you are feeding a wild animal, ask yourself if the close interaction is worth the consequences. There is a flower on the tropical island that the Johnsons want to take home so they are able to grow it. They put the plants in their bags and bring it back to the United States. This is harmful for the environment because everything plays a role in the ecosystem, so taking vegetation out of an ecosystem could disturb the food chain. Bringing non-indigenous plants to another country can also bring back foreign pests and diseases. Now that we have seen examples of negative effects of tourism, let's take a closer look at the beginning clips. These clips consist of wild fish being fed, humans being too close to wildlife, and snorkeling in shallow water with sunscreen on. Now that we have been informed, it is obvious that these things are harmful towards the environment. The ocean and wildlife attract people from all around the world. If tourists continue to make mistakes, the ecosystem will be destroyed. Being aware is the first step in lessening the harmful effects towards the environment. Plastic is often used due to its convenience, but by choosing a reusable water bottle, it can help to possibly save an animal's life. Small things like buying safe sunscreen, being cautious around coral reefs, and not feeding wildlife can help to save our environment.